Oh, this is wonderful. I feel like I can actually breathe again. Miss the old place, do you? Every day. You're always welcome to come back. Would that I could, but I enjoy London and my work too much. And an interesting document came across my desk the other day with your name on it. I had to read it three times to make sure I wasn't hallucinating. Have you told the engines? Not yet. I'm waiting for the right time. I must say, I never thought the day would come. Me neither. But it's for the best. We'll be poor without you, Topham. It's so good to see you. You look great. All right, that's the third good to see you and the second you look great since you arrived. What's on your mind, Bernard? This isn't just a social call, Topham. I probably shouldn't be telling you this, but some other reports have been crossing my desk about you and Sodor. They haven't been kind. What do they say? They claim this region has been suffering from a lack of leadership. This has led to lapses in discipline, negligence, and deficiencies in daily operations. And who's been making these reports? I don't know. Their name has been redacted. Whenever I see that, it's to protect the identity of whistleblowers. So it could be one of my own people? I can't believe that. Neither can I. Whoever this person is, they've really got it out for you. So much so that head office is planning to launch a surprise inspection next week. Fine. Let them come. We have nothing to hide. I didn't think you did, but I still feel you deserve to be warned. Glad to know you're still loyal, Bernard. <sighs> After last year, this is all we need. I'll say. How do you think the engines will react? Oh, I know exactly how. 